Hey Internet, it's RJ. Welcome back. Thanks for tuning into the show today. Now today's episode, we have $250 up for grabs, compliments of Amalgamated Bank, which is kind of a funny name for a bank, but doesn't matter. Their money spends all the same and we're here to take it. So typical fashion, we will cover this offer, terms and conditions, requirements, eligibility, everything you need to know to make Amalgamated's money become your money. So of course, if that sounds interesting to you, then go ahead, press the subscribe button and let's get to work. Now, when it comes to it, uh, first things first here, again, the uh, link will be down below, pinned comment, and our first link in the description, not a referral link, simply gets you where you need to go the fastest. Now, from what I understand, we haven't seen an offer from Amalgamated Bank since like 2016, something like that. I was only playing the credit card game at that point. I wasn't even doing this that much, so um, I don't know what other data points you come across. I don't really know how helpful they're going to be. It's smaller bank. There's a fair chance they haven't really changed anything on their system, so we'll link the doctor's post down below, but simply don't know how helpful they're going to be, so we can always get our own data points uh, started down below. But with that, let's get to work here, taking a look at the offer. And here we have it. We have a young lady. She seems very thrilled to be signing up for her new account. Why wouldn't she be? Because there's $250 on the table for the taking. So what do you have to do to take this money? Well, it's actually fairly simple. Requirements, open a new checking account, obviously. Fund the account by uh, February 15th of 2023. You're also going to need to enroll in online banking, so don't be a caveman. Uh, direct deposit $500 for two consecutive months. Has to be done by March 31st. I um, mean, of course, you cannot, it, the direct deposits from, I think, what I read can't be less than $500 each. Um, so you couldn't do like $250 and $250 to get $500. It just has to be $500 um, in the one direct deposit. And of course, this offer is going to be valid through January 31st of 2023. And so there we have it. Uh, requirements are pretty straightforward. Now, I haven't signed up for this yet. I do plan on signing up for it. Uh, you know, and you have quite a few, quite a time wise to complete it, but a uh, direct deposit was tied up at the moment. So I will definitely jump on this before, before the offer expires. Probably, fortunately, probably be next year for me in January, but that's fine. We got to start out earning $2023 at some point. But overall, requirements fairly simple here. You know, I say anytime there's a multi uh, multi month requirements, I always remind you that the uh, the bank account bonus tracker is at your at your uh, disposal down below. Should you want to use it, again, it's just a spreadsheet and a Google Drive that you can download, edit to your heart's content. I personally find it easier to keep track of multi month requirements that way. You know, because again, I you don't want to send your entire check over there for you know you know, a month, which would be two checks, right? You want to just split it up one and one if you can. So overall, again, requirements pretty straightforward. There you have it. Again, I would, if you're, if it's going to take you a while to do the direct deposits, I would probably just fund it at account opening. They always ask you for money. But if you're going to know this is going to be your very next direct deposit, then I think that's fine. I wouldn't fund it at opening. I would just use that uh, $500 to, you know, count as the funding and you'd be more than good as long as that hits before February. In addition to that, I didn't see any rules that the money has to stay over there. So again, if you're going to move the money out, which you probably should because it'll be like $1,000, leave a few dollars over there so they don't close your account. But again, overall, pretty straightforward on the requirements there. So with that, when we come to eligibility here, now this is nationwide offer, which is always great to see. Now they don't really specify what a new customer is. They just say one bonus per customer, which is always a little bit tricky and vague. So again, since we haven't seen this one in a long time, and I don't know how many people really have an amalgamated account. Um, you know, I think that'll be fine. A lot of people will be eligible, but I would still probably try it because they're vague. It just says one per customer, which is annoying when they don't nail it down. But, you know, I, I'd give it a try, even if you had an account in the past, personally, and see what happens. Um, so there you go. There's that. Now we talk about fees, and the good news is there is no fees on this account. So again, if you're going to zero, well, don't zero it out. Just leave a few dollars in there so they don't close it. But there's, there's no fees to worry about. I also didn't see any rules on early termination or account closure fees either. So, uh, you know, you're going to I think you're going to be here for a while. I think they actually specify they're not going to pay out to like June, which is insane, honestly. But, uh, you know, so it'll be more than it'll be like four to six months. Anyways, I, they probably will pay sooner, I would guess. Sometimes they just put that in there to give themselves room and so people don't bug them or uh, that'd be my guess. But it is technically in the term. So I would, uh, you know, plan on being here for a while. And after they pay out, you can just close it. So anyways, there is everything you need to know about Amalgamated Bank. So let's close out here with our summary slide to bring it home. And again, here we have it. Amalgamated Bank is the target. You want a checking account. I don't think it had a fun name, just checking account nationwide. You can make 250 bucks. Again, direct deposit $500 for two consecutive months. Enroll in online banking. And of course, make sure the account is funded by mid-February if you're you know, if it's going to be later on the direct deposit. And of course, uh, there are no fees and you can shut it down whenever you like. 
after they pay, of course. So anyways, guys, that has been Amalgamated Bank. Again, not a ton of data points on this one, so drop it down below what your experience has been as we go through this. Again, I will be signing up for this one, hopefully very shortly when I free up some direct deposit money, uh, but until then, you know, let me know what you find. I guess I'll, uh, I'll rely on your data points as then, but I don't expect any issues. It should be easy enough. So anyways, guys, that's going to do it for this one. If you liked it, drop me a thumbs up down below. If you found it particularly interesting, consider subscribing to the channel. Again, posting content just like this every week on how to make banks money become your money. Again, question for you guys is sound off down below. Let me know what you think about this one. Are you taking advantage of it? Love to hear your thoughts, especially on these nationwide ones, especially as we get close to starting a new year and having to start a new sheet on our bonus tracker for next year. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. We'll talk to you very soon in the next one.